Hey love bugs, this is Rosalyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. Namaste. Love and blessings, love and life, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when your girls have to upload that next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two, even if it's about being a hey or or just the comment and content of my video today. If you'd like to give a feedback, it'll greatly be appreciated. And if you enjoy what you heard and you feel like you resonate with it, please share the wills, share the knowledge, put thumbs up, go ahead and like and share. It'll greatly be appreciated. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel today and seeing what I'm about. And for my returning subs, what's up fam? Much love to you. Namaste. Love and blessings. Love and light. And many blessings are coming for you too. And thank you for taking the time out and stopping by my channel and seeing what's up with me today. And I'm listening to healing meditation music, jungle song, Zen Riki. Soft, relaxing bamboo flute music for yoga and spa. I will po post that link in the description box below. I love, I don't know what it is about the flute, but it sounds so peaceful. You hear wind chimes in the background. And it just it, it just feels like one of those kind of meditations that it helps you release a lot of, you know, it could be like if you're tense or, you know, it's just like you're getting a massage, but it's just like a massage with your brain on being able to set that balance in, you know, clear your chakras up and everything. But yeah, my video today is about Twin Flame 101, the spirit gods are talking. They are talking. They are really talking. And it's just like, you know, with all these shifts going on and people talking about raptures and, you know, you're seeing these, it, it just like you, I don't know what is really going on. I really don't know because it's just like I try to stay clear from the news. It's like we had two shootings here. And it, it's just like, if you're, you can't even turn on the news, pick up a newspaper without hearing about some kind of murder or some kind of explosive going off. Somebody's trying to do a uh, bombing suicide or, you know, shootings and stuff like that. And it's just like, you want to be able to feel safe. You want to be able to go and be able to do things with your friends and family and don't have to worry about, is this my last day? Because I'm going to be able to do those things. So it's just like, right now we have to get right with ourselves. That's what the spirit guides are saying. We got to get right. Because it's just like me thinking about the movie. It's like when I see things that are happening, I remember this movie called The Remaining. And it was a really deep movie. And I was just like, wow. You know, they went to this wedding and stuff like that. And it's just like people that they were seeing left and right was just disappearing left and right, left and right. And then this girl was like, I heard about this before. I heard about this before and it was like something about the remaining it's like the rapture it's just like you know God's coming down and picking people left and right you know left and right that he will be ready to take home because obviously they're setting up <laughs> they're setting up something and it, it's just like it feels like the remaining it feels like Independence Day the first one when um was his name Jeff Goldblum was talking about how the aliens sit up here and set up posts before they plan their attack and I'm not saying we're under attack but obviously the universe is setting up something setting up something you know people are dying left and right you know it, it's just like more and more celebrities are starting to pass away and it, it's just like people are the things that could have been easily prevented, there was a reason behind it, you know, and it's just like so many things that they're sending us and so many signs and synchronicities just letting us know, you know, you need to be prepared for whatever's coming and you need to get right with whoever you, your higher power is, you better get right with it. <laughs> you better get right with it because you do not want to be caught in a crossfire of things that's going on and you probably have sensed it. You know, you probably have a burst of energy. Your emotions are all over the place. You're probably more sensitive and more aware of more things than you usually were before. 
you know, and that's all the universe and the spirit guides are trying to let you know to pay attention to the things that are presented to you, that's shown to you in your face. Get prepared and, you know, be ready for whatever's coming because whatever's coming is coming in full force. You know, I, I try to meditate, get right, you know, whatever I got left that I'm still trying to deal with, heal from that mess and keep it moving and just be, you know, stay prayed up and do what you need to do. Because it's just, when you're going through all these things and, you know, you pray to whoever you're praying to and just trust and know that they hear all the things that you're talking about and just know that the, whatever you're, you're praying for and it's in a positive way and it's coming from the heart and you're doing the things that you're going to do, you don't have nothing to worry about because it's just like I try to get right and I don't worry about where I'm going. You know, because I already know where I'm going because that's why I'm trying to live right and do what I need to do. So when you're on this path and you, you see the things that are going on, listen to what the spirit guides have to tell you. Obviously, they're presenting stuff to you in a reason and they're putting stuff on your path for a reason. So listen to what they have to say. You never know where it might lead you to. So I will talk to you later. I hope you are able to resonate and get something out of my video today. I will definitely keep you in my prayers and most definitely I'll, uh, I hope you do the same for me. Like and subscribe if you have not already. Drop me a line or two if you feel comfortable enough. I love to get to know you and get to hear from you. And it will be greatly appreciated. Give me a thumbs up, like, and even share. And I will see you on my next video. No, and I'm actually, I just want, I want more love for you, more frequency. So I hope you're having a good day, and I hope you have a rest of a prosperous, prosperous, blessed week. And then I will see you on my next video. Now I'm done. <laughs> Peace. Love you. Mwah. Be wild.